In 2018, I received the message of everything changing, and they said this was because there was a portal, a very important port portal that would take two years to close, and we had to take a benefit from it. That was the portal of time and space. The key was the number two, time and space, two things. So I said 2020, 2020. So February 2nd, 0202, 02, 2020. 2222, two, 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 it's eight. So it's the infinite time. So the portal of time would start that day. And the last day of the portal would be 12, which is space which number would give me 12. That would be February 22nd, 2022. So in between the eight space and 12 time, you would have the great portal, 2020, 2021, from February to February, 2022. So in that time, I was supposed to do the whole task, connect the network, inform everyone what is the I am, and reach every spot in the planet. <laughs> and they said, and also um, you, you have to do it while the entire planet stop and meditate. And everyone must think about the crown of the planet because the crown of the planet, the North Pole is changing. So everyone has to have in their mind the crown of the planet. So one of my guides told me, you're not going to do, do this alone, but you have to remember that you are not part of the circle. You are the center. You have to pick 12 persons that will help you to do the activation around the world. This was late 2019, and I did the list of people. One of them was my husband 12,000 years ago, who is a friend of mine now. He was one of the persons that 12,000 years ago in front of the Sphinx, that was my first memory, told me whenever is needed and the moment it arrives, I will be here with you. Doesn't matter which time, doesn't matter our bodies. So I wrote to him and he said, of course I will go. So 12,000 years after, in front of the Sphinx, he was there with me, beginning this. <laughs> so it's a perfect cycle of 12,000 years of <laughs> working with someone. So I choose some of the closest friends that I would trust that we could do work with. And I took them all to Egypt for the portal of time. And we all together did this activation with 144 people that came also for us. And we went all to the Great Pyramid and did this activation to open this portal of time and to allow us to do everything that we had to do. And during this activation in February is when they told us that the world will stop. So I was supposed to go to France for one or two months to learn French because in one of the nodes that I was supposed to go, Il Amsterdam, in the Indian Ocean, in the Austral territories of France, they only accept you if you speak French because the whole crew of the boats only speak French. So basically, you have to know French. So I said, okay, that's one of the notes, so I have to go, so I will go and learn French. So when I arrived to Nancy, where I was staying, my guides told me, so now sit down and wait for five months until the next signal to come. And I said, but I have to start traveling because it's impossible in six months to do the whole trip. We, I need at least one year. If I don't start now, how am I going to do it? And I said, everything is changing. Now the planet will meditate. So it will be easier to get to those spots. All you have to do is to take care that everyone understand what is the I am. I said, OK. Uh, I was a little bit frustrated because I've been since 2015 organizing this trip. And they just said a few months before, no, it's not going to be done <laughs> that way. So it was like, uh, OK. So I said, why all this? And they said, to learn, to learn stuff. So you learn many things. Now you know French. Congratulations. <laughs> so all these kind of things. And OK, so that's when we started to 
film another season of uh, Initiation in France. And we started to film also these stories that happened to me. And it was funny because I was telling all these stories and I remember uh, that I said, I, I can't tell these stories. I, I don't know, I, I'm, I don't feel the emotion to tell them. I, I, I feel lost. I was like frustrated because my trip was wrong and everything was bad and I don't know. And I said, I don't know if this makes any sense to film all this. So I went to take a breath outside and suddenly in the wall there was like the symbol that I always do, which is this, is an old ancient symbol of, of alignment with the spirit and, and the soul. And it was like a dove in the wall with this symbol, with the hand. And it said, you know what? Yes, it's all fine. <laughs> it's, let's do it. Let's do it. I, I will keep filming. I will keep doing this because the signal was so clear. So I came back to Nancy for these three months of quarantine, but I couldn't hear any of my guides. I was asking, what should I do? What should I do? What should I do? And nothing, nothing, nothing. It was silent, silence, silence, totally silent. So I was like really concerned on what to do. And this day that I wasn't expecting for anything, I went to the bathroom to pee. And while I was peeing, I just feel someone here behind and said, now we have to talk about it. And I was like, why now? <laughs> why now? Let me just wash my hands at least. It's like, I don't know why they choose this moment. Sometimes they don't understand <laughs> that the body has some needs. So they said, now is the moment to speak about it. We have to do this and this. And uh, so while I was in the bathroom trying to clean my hands, <laughs> uh, he was explaining to me about how the I am would be. So I explained all this in YouTube while I was ironing the sheets of the bed. Everything was so weird. Uh, so they told me to do that, like, be normal. So I was just explaining all this while I was ironing. And, and everyone was, I, I don't know if everyone got it, but, uh, but the message was there. So in this, in, in this process of not, uh, I understood to clarify things, to make it more simple. Everyone got it when I was, when they saw me ironing and explaining that I was peeing and my guide told me about what is the I am. So they said, now you're ready to go to the place where represents everywhere in the world, which is the Great Pyramid of Egypt.